Hi everybody, sorry I've been kind of MIA for the last couple of weeks, but I have a new video and I'm really excited to show you this one. I took it maybe like two and a half weeks ago when all of the college students moved out. And so as you'll see in the video, the dumpsters are just full and full and full. So I hope you enjoy it and I will try to post more regularly from now on. But here you go. So I can already see right here, there's a ton of clothes on top. This looks like a pretty dress or skirt or something. Um, these bags on the bottom, I'll want to go through them maybe a little bit, but they look like, for the most part, it's trash in here. Oh, that's Forever 21. Okay, so I will start a pile over here of stuff I'm keeping. Oh my gosh, all right. So this big piece of glass I'm gonna take off because I feel like that's gonna fall and break. All right, it is a cute skirt. Um, I don't see where it's from right now, but I'll keep that. Okay, I might have to put the phone down for this one because it's so full. Well, here, I'll come over here. Oh, look, here's some shoes. Oh, those aren't really in great shape. So... Oh, that's cute. It's like a dad hat with a panda. Keep that. Oh, uh, reusable bags. I love finding reusable bags. This is label of, oh, H&M. Okay. Here's the other shoe. Those are actually in pretty good condition. They need new laces, but they look all right. Yeah, I'll keep those. Here's some more hats. That one's cute. This is actually probably a nice hat for me to wear while I dive. <laughs> I'm always getting so sunburned. So I'm gonna grab a box or something just so people don't think I'm making like a bigger mess. So here, I'll just start putting them in this. All right, I'm gonna put the phone down for a minute and try to just get some of this stuff out of here because I'm having trouble like really reaching stuff so all right I'll be back okay so I've taken what I'm gonna take from this one um, the only other things I found were one pair of athletic pants and then this Nike hat which I don't know if you can tell it's like really dingy um, but I'm gonna take it home and bleach it and see if that changes it at all I don't even feel like I can get over there. All right, let me see like all that right there. This is all just like kitchen supplies and food it looks like. Victoria's Secret. Nice. 
I've read and heard that Pink by Victoria's Secret is like the best seller on Poshmark, but I have a couple pink items and I have not sold them, so. Okay, Denton. Sure. It's like a bomber jacket. That's kind of cool. Basic American Eagle tee. I'm starting to find a couple textbooks, which there's a shop. Oh, whoops. There's a shop. Um, close by that <laughs> buys uh, textbooks so I'm gonna try to find some more and take them over there this is crazy this is another dumpster at this same apartment complex that's just overflowing with stuff so I guess one thing that I want to try to brainstorm or research a little bit more is like how do you even prevent this from happening. How do you prevent all of the college students who are moving out at the end of this month? Like, how do you maybe putting donation bins besides, beside all the dumpsters that are in the apartment complex, just making, somehow making it more easily accessible for people to donate this stuff as opposed to just throwing it into the trash. Granted, a lot of it is trash. That's for sure there's a ton of trash in there but there's also a lot of really good usable things that other people would really benefit from so if you have any suggestions on that or if you have like links to articles that talk about how do we stop people from just throwing it away is it education is it setting up donation bins by the dumpsters like how do we fix this problem because i don't know all right third dumpster at this apartment complex insane. There's a bicycle. Here's a ton of the same shirt. Well, I'll take that just to donate it at least. Here's a full <laughs> cup of soda. So where do I even start? I'll start by moving this giant thing over here. This looks like it might have some good stuff. There's pants. This bag. All right, that's all closed. So I'll just move all of the stuff that I'm gonna wanna sort through over here. Um, I don't know, that one's heavy. It might have something good. This is clothes. This is at least some clothes, because I can see shoes right there. But there's also some trash. Okay, I'll still move it over here. Is that more clothes right there? Kinda... Okay, no, that one's actual trash. This one is something though. Okay, I'm gonna get this bike out and see if it works. So, hold on. It doesn't have a seat and the tires are completely flat. So I'm not gonna mess with it. Let's see. Oh boy, okay. Another reusable bag. That's a shirt right there. I'm just trying to figure out how to get to it. What's in here? This is like all party supplies. All right, I gotta put the phone down again, y'all. This is 
so much stuff. Okay. Just found this PS1 with Spyro in it and one controller. So who knows if it works, but that's pretty cool. <laughs> I like, think that's really neat. Okay. I also found all of these like Dickies workman shirts and they still have the tags on them. I don't know if they're worth anything because they like are branded with that. So I'm not really sure about those. Okay. There's so much that it's hard to even see. I don't think what I'm standing on is very sturdy. <laughs> but I want to try to get this bag. Oh, and look, there's a bag of hangers, which I need. Oh, shoot. All right. All right, let's see. Okay. I don't know what is in this bag, but it's heavy. It's full of shoes. Okay. Oh, those are in nice shape. There's the other one. Oh my god, those are in really good condition. And Perry Ellis. I don't know, but those are really nice too. Some pins. Magic the Gathering cards, a quarter. <laughs> what about in the front pocket? Lots of school supplies, pins, pencils. Um, okay. Anything back here? Uh, <laughs> a really mushy pop tart. Okay. Oh, that's full though. That's nice. I'll keep that. I don't want this bag. This is wild. And this is still the first apartment complex I've gone to today. Alright, I'm gonna put the phone down. This is a bag of hangers. So I'm gonna look through that real quick. All right, so I spent over an hour in one apartment complex with three dumpsters. That literally has never happened. So I got everything that I could like find since they were so full, it was hard to really dig, but I'm going to go to some more and hopefully they're just as packed. So this apartment complex has a like construction dumpster and there's a ton of stuff in it there's a desk Okay, let's see what I can see right off the bat. All right, I'm gonna go from a different angle. Let's see. Okay, so I pulled out from this big dumpster, which this is weird. I actually have one of these already at home. Um, and it's the same thing, like it's new with the tag. And I had a lot of people interested. So I am gonna take that. And then I found this bag of clothes but this still has the tag on it, on fire. Okay, so I'm gonna sort through these clothes and then see if we can find anything else.
Okay, this is not sweat. I spilled water on myself. <laughs> I mean, it is really hot. I'm really sweaty, but not this sweaty, just to clarify. Okay, I'm at another dumpster. Um, there's actually a guy walking over here right now with a bunch of trash. So I'm not gonna get out yet in case he's coming to this dumpster. So I'll just wait. Totally full. I'm hoping I can get up there and get some stuff out of it. This is cool. It's like a racing jacket. Literally got to these dumpsters just in time. There's this guy taking them away now. <laughs> yep, he's got it all hooked up. So that was good timing. A new apartment complex. Another really full dumpster. All right, first things I see. These shorts are super cute. It's actually kind of a cute futon. Whew. All right. It's only 85 or something today, which is cool for how it has been, but it feels really hot. to get into to really dig so I decided to keep looking for just a minute longer and I'm glad I did I found uh, these are forever 21 distressed jeans and then this is a forever 21 skirt and it still has a tag on it so that's really great Xbox controller. So all those textbooks and the Xbox controller. Whew. So it is now 2 p.m. I started diving around like 9.30. So I'm pretty exhausted. You can see the car is like filled with stuff. I got hangers. I've really needed hangers um, to like hang up all the clothes that I'm collecting for Poshmark and everything. So I found like a whole trash bag full of those, which is going to be really helpful uh, in organizing. But okay, so I'm at two more dumpsters. <laughs> I'm so tired. I'm going to do these and then I'm probably going to go home for a little bit and cool down. Okay, here we go. Oh, this is nice. Okay, this is a hanger that I wanted. Cause I've just been using like these, this like white style one that's like really basic, but this wooden one will help like spruce up my listings a little bit. Okay, so I picked up this Victoria's Secret gift card off the ground because I love finding gift cards even though they never really have anything on them. This card I just called $20 on it. It's never been used and it's to Victoria's Secret. So pretty exciting. Currently, I am trying to get out all of these unopened canned goods. So there's this big bag on top though that keeps, okay. I'm gonna pull this off for a second. And take this. Wow, okay. This is like someone's pantry. I'm definitely gonna take all those. Here's another box. So Asparagus, you got chicken noodle soups, beans, 
tomatoes. Another dumpster. I am out here looking through these bags right now. Um, I think the majority of these are, yeah, like shoes and clothes and bras and all kinds of stuff. So I'm going to spend some time looking through all of these. What is So there's an iPhone. <laughs> I'm going to plug this in. I mean, obviously it's cracked really bad. But I sold, I found a Google um, Plus and I sold it on eBay for $20 and it was way more cracked than this one. Oh look, it's powering on. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna let that charge. That's crazy. Now I definitely wanna look through like every inch of this stuff. Dang, I can't believe there was an iPhone in here. All right, I'm gonna put the phone down for a minute. Well, I'll keep looking. It's some type of dance leotard. That's pretty, but it has a big stain. Crop top. No, you want it? All right, so I'm done here. It's so hot outside. Um, I found this this is what i'm taking this bag right here of clothes i found like four or five victoria's secret uh pink sports bras but i found a lot of really good like brand name stuff and then obviously i found the iphone which is charging so i'm gonna see right now if it will turn on Moment of truth. <laughs> no SIM card. Okay, but I think that's fine, right? Like you can get a replacement SIM card. Cause this is a, I mean, this is one of the newer ones, right? It's a six or something. I guess six is not new at all. Let's see if it, um. Huh, well, it works, it vibrates. I'll definitely be able to sell that on eBay. Awesome. So as you can see, the car is full. So I'm gonna go get water, I'm gonna go shower, and then, oh my God, I'm gonna pull all this stuff out of the car and look through it again. Okay, well, thanks for watching. I might not do like a full, laid out of this haul just because it's so much stuff um, but my favorite thing that I found today is the iPhone and the Victoria's Secret gift card for $20 so there you have it all this <laughs> my trunk probably like a hundred or more articles of clothing that might be really low but that's what I'm gonna estimate so pretty cool. I'm super excited to get home and wash it and list all of this stuff. So this was a long day. I am ready for a nap and I will see y'all next time. Bye. <laughs>